flu. Uh, so two weeks on tea, voice comparison video thing. Um, the only thing I noticed, I don't know, you could probably see, is I am greasy everywhere. Well, not everywhere. My head, my face is just greasy. My my chest, my shoulders, back of my neck. Ah, oh, it's gross. I feel like I'm constantly covered in sun cream or something. Oh, it's horrible. Because when I, I went through, through <coughs> first puberty, let's say it that way. <coughs> oh, I got a cough. Um, I never had any skin problems. I was never particularly greasy. I never had any spots. I've always had really good skin. So now I'm like looking at myself, touching my forehead every five minutes, which is probably not helping. Because I'm like, oh, I'm just shiny all the time. So, yeah, puberty's hit. Which is fine. But yeah, a bit weird to be greasy all the time. Um, I haven't, no, well, I haven't noticed much change in my voice other than sometimes on the talk I feel like my my voice box feels weird a little bit. Um, and I'm coughing now because I think I'm, I'm I think it's because I'm tired. <coughs> I had a um not a shred well it was an instant at my GP surgery. Um yeah we we, we won't go into that but. I will say I won't be going back. I'll uh, be going back for my um, next jab, and then I'm moving. <laughs> I'm not going back again. Um, yeah, but I've just noticed how tired I look. But it's because I am tired. One week I aim to do one of these videos in the daytime when I don't look haggard and horrible, and in better light as well. Um, what? Dogs are shouting at me. Come here then. Thanks, Scrubby. Oh. <laughs> Get out of my face. Good boy. Go over there. Thank you. Yeah, um, oh, he's such a baby. Yeah, so next injection is two weeks, 19th of September. It's not long, long really. Um, appetite's increased a little bit, but I don't, I, again, I don't know whether that's because I'm tired and I, I just want crap all the time or what, but I know I've gained three pounds in two weeks and I previously was doing Slim World and now I'm just a bit like, oh. I've lost my motivation for a little bit and I can't be really bothered and I don't know whether to take some time off and go back in January. You know, once the testosterone had a few months to, I don't know, kick in properly or do whatever it's doing and, ch you know, change my body or carry on and maybe it's just that I need to re-motivate myself a a again. I don't, I don't know quite what to do, but it's something I'm going to, I'm not going to go tomorrow, I can't go tomorrow because I've got to wait in for, um, my toilet needs fixing because when I flush it, it keeps leaking a little bit, like the pipe at the back, um, and there's a leak down, like, in the bin shed below me as well, so that needs to be sorted too, so I've got to stay in for that tomorrow, but, yeah, don't know what to do with Slim World because part part of it is, yeah, I've lost motivation and I just can't be bothered because it's a lot of it's not hard work. It's just you know, and it it's it is and it isn't restrictive in different ways, but it's hard having to deal with you know lots of different things like mental health forms, physical health forms, and then being like having to be aware all the time of what you're putting into your body and I've got I've, I've been there for about four and a half months and I've got to the point where I'm just like I, I don't want to be aware of what I'm putting into my body anymore I just want to deal with the rest of my life as it is because it's difficult enough as it is without 
worrying about, oh, you know, am I eating properly? Have I gained this week? Have I, I maintained? Have I done X, Y, and Z? So, yeah. So I don't know what I'm going to do. Yeah, but I'm not, I'm not, like I said, I'm not going to go this week. So I'll take this week to think about what I'm going to do from next week on. So I might have gained some inspiration and some motivation, but at the moment, re recently I've been really tired and my mood's been all right ish, but I've been tired. And I've just wanted to sleep. I've just wanted to hibernate. <laughs> I just want to eat and sleep. I don't want to do anything else. But, yeah, I don't know. We shall see. Anyway, that was quite a long video. Nearly six minutes. Six minutes now. Um. Yeah. I suppose I needed to get that off my chest a little bit. But I won't be blogging tonight. Because it's too late. And I want to go to bed. And I got new GP surgery to look at tomorrow <laughs> and medication to pick up that oh god has taken a week and a half to sort out because they can't possibly ever sort my medication out I can't just go and order medication and then go and pick it up it never works like that I don't understand why it doesn't work like that usually works like that but clearly Someone's not doing their job properly, and I I can't help but get annoyed because it's really frustrating when you're trying to sort out ten plus medications and nobody's doing their job properly. So yeah, so I feel like at the moment I've just been fighting, fighting and fighting for and for everything, and it's frustrating. And there's still two hospitals, there's Southampton and Poor Hospital that I really need to get hold of to sort some appointments out that I just can't get hold of. It's just like, what do you need me to do? Come there and physically speak to you because nobody's answering the phone? Where is everybody? What are you all doing? I know you're all, the NHS is stressed, but jeez, answer the phone. <laughs> People have got things to sort out. But, I don't know, so I've got to try and sort that out. Because I, I was meant to have an ears, nose and throat appointment in, well, 19th of September. But they've changed it to January. Which is fine, I don't mind they changing it. But it's what, just September? Four months. More, like, more longer that I've got to wait. Change it to the you know end of the month. Change it to the end, beginning of October. That's fine. Don't change it for four months time, and then not answer the phone when you're like, well, I need that appointment sooner. I can't wait four months. It needs to be this year at least. But yeah, we should you know we shan't go uh, too much down that road because otherwise I won't come back. But, um, yeah, anyway, voice comparison video, back to that subject. Other than the greasiness, that's all I've really noticed. And the, some someone's my throat. I, f I sound like, I feel like I sound like I've got a sore throat, even though I haven't got a sore throat. Which is weird. But, that's how my friend described it earlier, anyway. But, yeah, so it's it. How, what's the time now? Yes, it's half past eleven, so I'm going to bed now. Alright. Peace.